This is Dabu7. We have an alert here in terms of possible grid fluctuations that people could see here in connection with these back-to-back -back solar flares that are going to be delivering basically a one-two punch here anywhere from tonight into tomorrow. This is coming from a CME that lifted up off the sun on Sunday and then another one that let loose on the 4th of July. They say that this most recent one is moving really quick and it looks to catch up to the one from Sunday and any, anywhere from tonight into Friday, we could expect to see some geomagnetic effects here and some storms popping up in connection with this. Now, they also say here that these G1 level storms are going to kick up auroras all the way down to the mid latitudes. So anyone out there that's got clear skies here in the next 24, 48 hours, you could catch quite a show in the heavens from these CMEs. We've been seeing more and more of this. We've been seeing things like air glow. And this is all part of an increase in the sun's activity. It is reaching the height of this solar cycle, solar cycle 25, this 11 year run of activity. And right now we're entering the peak of it a little ahead of schedule. But these storms can cause some power fluctuations. They can cause some grid failure in certain places. And of course, as more activity picks up, those odds increase as well. And we don't wanna see a Carrington event happen this day and age. If so, a lot of people are going to be hurting. I hope you have a plan for such an event. We've been warning for a decade. Join me on the live.